The Team America Rocketry Challenge, now in its 12th year of existence, is the largest student rocket contest in the world. Each year, more than 700 teams compete for their chance to attend the national finals, where the top 100 teams face off against one another. As the anchor educational outreach program for our industry's goals in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, or STEM, the Rocket Contest challenges middle and high school students to develop the critical skills they will need for the future. You know, one of the exciting things about the Team America Rocketry Challenge is it really does get kids involved in the cutting edge of technology and science. And that's what it's going to take for us to remain globally competitive. We have over 5,000 kids all around the country with their parents and coaches and professionals from the National Association of Rocketry who all year work on this competition to then have the final contest for the national award right here in Virginia. Thanks to Raytheon, the winning team goes on to the Farnborough Air Show and competes there with other teams from around the globe. This year's competition is one of the toughest we've had. It has two parachutes that have to deploy, two eggs that have to be landed safely, no cracking, and there's a very tight window, 48 to 50 seconds, that they've got to accomplish this in. So it's a very tough competition. AIA is hard at work, ensuring that awareness of TARC extends well beyond the students involved. With the help of teams themselves, the TARC story is shared year-round with the news media. In 2014 alone, well over 2,000 news stories and thousands more social media hits amplified awareness of TARC. And the day before the big launch, TARC once again took its story to the halls of Congress with Rockets on the Hill. This event gave teams the opportunity to engage with their members of Congress and highlight to lawmakers the need for increased STEM education awareness and funding. Rocketry is not simple in itself, and now they're doing things like applying 3D printing to making parts for the rockets, which is something that is very advanced, even by standards of aerospace and defense manufacturers who fall by industry. The designing, building, and testing of rockets for this competition help set the stage for our future workforce. And this year, students from Creekview High School took first for their superior effort. Congratulations to this team from Canton, Georgia. And on behalf of today's students, tomorrow's workforce, and our entire industry, we applaud and thank our Team America Rocketry Challenge sponsors for their generous support. <laughs>